Imagine space as this crazy huge orchestra with stars, planets, and moons all playing together in tune. But there's one group of players that's been grabbing astronomers' attention. Exoplanets, they're like hidden worlds outside our solar system, tucked away in the Milky Way. What's wild is that some of these exoplanets are super similar to Earth, maybe even like a twin. Let's check out Proxima b, a planet only 4.2 light years away. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is changing the game when it comes to seeing these far off places. Think about the Milky Way, packed with tons of exoplanets. If each one was a grain of sand, they'd fill up the Grand Canyon, and then some. And get this, about 20% of these planets are kinda like Earth, based on their geology and air. That means for every five exoplanets, one could be just like home. But wait, there's more. A bunch of these planets might also have moons, just like ours. Space.com says that if you're waiting for another space thing that could have life, the universe is full of possibilities. Now, let's talk about the JWST. It's like this super cosmic camera with a giant mirror that's way bigger than Hubble's. It can spot the faintest light from stars way far away and study the planets circling them. The JWST isn't just strong. It's got cool tech like infrared detectors and tools that can break down light from space stuff. This helps us figure out what's in their air, what they're made of, and if they have stuff like water or breathable air. It's a total game changer. If Hubble wowed you, prepare to be amazed. One star system that's getting a lot of looks is Proxima. B. Since we found it in 2016, it's been a big mystery that everyone's talking about. Why is it so special? Well, it's pretty close, only 4.2 light years away. If you could zoom at light speed, you'd get there in just over four years. Since it's close and seems to have potential, finding it feels like spotting a diamond in the rough. It could give us clues about life and our spot in the universe. Folks think Proxima b might not just be similar to Earth, but like a twin, it's in the right spot around its star where it could have liquid water. Imagine alien waterfalls and big oceans, but hold up, it's weird too. A day on Proxima b lasts 11 Earth days. Imagine long sunrises and sunsets. It makes you wonder how that'd mess with the weather, and if we could live there. Would we need more food or sleep? Would time even feel the same? It'd be familiar, but super strange. It's a puzzle. Could life there be like ours? This makes us rethink what we think makes a world livable. The JWST is a powerhouse. But how do we get good info about a planet we can't visit? The JWST uses all its tech to tackle that. It floats in space and lets scientists check out these distant worlds with fancy tools using infrared detectors and light splitting tools. The telescope can read the energy coming from these planets. By breaking down what the light is made of, scientists can do a remote checkup on these alien worlds and measure air pressure, how thick the air is, and if they have stuff like water or oxygen. The JWST lets scientists replace guesses with real info. It's reshaped how we understand the universe and what's doable beyond. Earth, and just when you think the universe couldn't shock us more, something did. Scientists using the JWST spotted a weird signal coming from Proxima b. It was so odd and complex that it made everyone freak out. It made folks wonder again, are we alone? This signal was unlike anything they'd seen before. It seemed on purpose, maybe even from smart life. For a moment, people thought maybe another civilization was trying to reach out. But then, just as quick, the signal was gone. It left a bunch of questions and theories. Was it just a weird space thing, or was it a message from a civilization? Far, far away, kinda like a coded hello. Whatever it was, that signal turned Proxima b into a big deal. It became a symbol of hope and wonder. What if this is part of something bigger? Something that connects us to other life out there. Even though we don't know for sure, all this makes us want to explore more and see that we're a part of something grander. Searching for alien lights is the next thing. It's adding another layer to all this. Old thinkers are using the JWST sort of like space night vision. They want to scan exoplanets for man-made lights, like cityscapes shining under alien skies. Dot crazy, right? An alien city glowing in the dark. While it sounds like a movie, it's becoming possible. Spotting unnatural lights wouldn't just mean they're smart life but that it's organized. Life like ours might be all over the place. And what would that mean? For us, it'd change everything. Beliefs, politics, science. We'd go from being alone on Earth to members of something bigger. Dot. New questions would pop up, like how do we say hi, what would we learn, and what stories would we tell each other. So, as the JWST looks farther than anyone before, and as we try to pick up even the quietest sounds from space, one thing's obvious. The universe isn't quiet anymore. It's starting to speak. The question is, are we ready? If you're waiting for evidence of another space object that could sustain life or is already doing so, the universe offers infinite chances. Now that we've started to expose the sheer scale of the cosmos, it's time to introduce the master artisan capable of capturing its fine details, the James Webb Space Telescope. 
This cosmic observer with a mirror instead of a magnifying glass exceeds even the most advanced imaging tools. Its 6.5 meters primary mirror, 2.7 times larger than Hubble's, gives it the ability to detect the faintest. Stellar flickers billions of light years away and study the planets that orbit them. However, the James Webb Telescope is revolutionary not only because of its unrivaled observational strength, but also due to its high-tech components, which include infrared detectors and spectrographic tools. These instruments don't just observe, they dissect the specific wavelengths of light emitted or reflected by cosmic objects to decode their atmospheric makeup, elemental composition, density, and mass. Acting like celestial forensic analysts, they can detect if a planet has water, carbon-based compounds, or even breathable air. The James Webb isn't just a refined version of Hubble, it's a giant leap ahead. If Hubble's insights left you in awe, brace yourself for a whole new level of discovery as we continue to probe the intricacies of the universe. One particular star system calls for our attention, Proxima b, since its discovery in 2016. This captivating planet has become the centerpiece of a cosmic narrative filled with riddles and contradictions that has gripped both scientists and space enthusiasts. What makes Proxima be exceptional? First, it's in our celestial backyard, only 4.2 light years away. To put that in relatable terms, if you could travel at the speed of light, you'd reach Proxima B in just over four years. That's the length of a presidential term or the time it takes for a fashion trend to fade away. But the closeness of this planet is more than a convenience. In a universe that spans 93 billion light years across, discovering a world this close and this rich in potential is like uncovering a rare gem in a mountain of rubble. This gem could hold vital clues about life and our place in the cosmic narrative. Proxima B's intrigue isn't just about distance. Scientists speculate it could not only resemble Earth, but might be Earth's mirror image, Earth 2.00 positioned in the habitable zone of its star, where temperatures are just right. It might support liquid water. Imagine waterfalls plunging from alien cliffs, expansive rivers winding through unknown terrains, and vast oceans as deep and enigmatic as the Mariana Trench. But before we pack our bags for a future vacation to Proxima B, we must examine some of its unique quirks. For instance, a single day on Proxima B stretches over 11 Earth days. Think of sunrises that take hours to bloom into daylight, followed by drawn-out sunsets bathed in golden hues. Though it sounds picturesque, it raises compelling questions about climate and livability. Would human biology adapt to this prolonged cycle of light and darkness? Would we need more food or sleep? Would time feel the same? Existence on Proxima B would be both strangely recognizable and entirely foreign. Nature offers a puzzle within a paradox. Could life on Proxima be resembled? Ours. This question shakes the very foundation of what we believe makes a world habitable. The James Webb Space Telescope is not just a tool, it's a scientific powerhouse. But how can we gather accurate, trustworthy data about a planet we've never set? Foot on. The JWST utilizes every bit of its technological arsenal to confront that question, functioning as a floating laboratory in orbit. Thanks to its groundbreaking design, scientists are no longer limited to mere observation. They can deeply examine these far-off worlds with advanced instruments. Using infrared detectors and light-splitting spectrographs, the telescope can interpret the electromagnetic energy radiating from or reflected by these remote planets. By breaking down the exact light wavelengths absorbed or emitted by various chemicals in a planet's atmosphere, researchers can essentially perform a remote biopsy of these alien worlds. This lets them measure air pressure, atmospheric thickness, and the potential presence of life, friendly elements like water vapor, carbon compounds, and even oxygen. JWST isn't just another observatory. It's a breakthrough in analytical engineering. It empowers scientists to replace educated guesses with verified knowledge reshaping our grasp of the universe and redefining what we believe is possible beyond our planet. And just when we thought the universe couldn't surprise us further, something astonishing happened. Scientists working with the JWST detected an unexpected signal from Proxima B a transmission so unique, so intricately structured that it sent shockwaves through the scientific community and viral discussions. Across the internet, it reignited the age-old question, are we alone? This electromagnetic anomaly was unlike anything previously logged. It was so refined and repetitive in its pattern that it suggested something deliberate, potentially the result of advanced intelligence. For a brief moment, the collective imagination of humanity paused, electrified by the idea that another form of sentient life might be reaching out across the stars. But just as mysteriously as it appeared, the signal vanished, leaving behind a chilling quiet, a cascade of theories, and a vast landscape of unanswered questions. Was it merely a rare space disturbance, a fleeting irregularity in the cosmos? Or was it something more? A subtle message from an intelligent civilization far beyond our own. 
Could it have been a coded beacon or a long lost echo from a distant society trying to reach us across time? Whatever it was, that lone signal turned Proxima B into more than a subject of astronomical interest. It became a magnetic focal point for our hopes, fears, and curiosities. It transformed from a promising planet to a symbol of possibility. The implications are extraordinary. Could this be one chapter in a larger, more intricate storyline? One that binds us to an expansive interstellar family. Though certainty remains elusive, one thing is clear. This mystery only strengthens our curiosity. It propels not only science, but also the fundamental human desire to reach out to discover that we are part of something far greater. Searching for artificial light, the next frontier in alien world research, adds another dimension to this mission. Our story doesn't stop here. As new innovations take shape, the JWST, no longer a passive observer, but an active space detective, is being reimagined by bold thinkers as something akin to a cosmic night vision system. Their ambitious goal to scan exoplanets not just for organic evidence of life, but for signs of man-made illumination. Yes, artificial light, street lights, cityscapes, vast metropolises glowing under alien skies. Visualize the wonder. A thriving alien civilization casting energy into the cosmos. Visible not through natural indicators, but by their engineered radiance. A city sparkling on the dark side of a distant globe. A synthetic glow breaking through the blackness of deep space. Though it sounds like science fiction, this concept is rapidly entering the realm of scientific feasibility. Detecting unnatural lighting wouldn't merely point to intelligent life. It would hint at something systematic. A cosmic rhythm. Intelligence like life may be a repeating pattern across the stars. And what would such a discovery mean for us? It would rewrite philosophies, challenge religious teachings, reshape world politics, and revolutionize our understanding of science. In a single transformative moment, humanity would evolve from isolated beings on a blue planet to recognize members of a broader, perhaps ancient cosmic civilization. New questions would emerge, questions deeper than we've ever dared to ask. How would we initiate contact? What knowledge would they share? Most intriguingly, what stories would we tell each other? So, as the James Webb Space Telescope gazes farther than any eye before it, and as we tune our instruments to detect even the faintest murmurs from the void, one thing becomes undeniably clear. The universe is no longer silent. It is murmuring, maybe even speaking. The question is, are we ready? T.